Hello, it's Kathy. Welcome to Willow Plume Notes. I had a huge Timu haul and I've split it up into multiple parts because I didn't want them to really run over 30 minutes. So I am going over all of my stuff in great detail. That way you can see if you really want to get the item. Obviously, a lot of the stuff is from 60 cents to a dollar to four to I think this one was probably my most expensive item that I bought. So I'm going to go over this solely on this video and then I'll go over the rest of my items that I have, like my paper haul and stuff. <music> a video already on a few of the items like these awesome little clips pins that have jewelry in them so cute as well as a hundred charms that come in this set very affordable charms that I can add to my journals and such so I did that so go ahead and check out those videos that I have on my channel and so today I'm gonna focus on going through this set of stickers there are nine of them and each book has 50 sheets in them. let's go and go through a detailed view of these stickers i'm excited to go ahead and start using them so i definitely want to go ahead and share them with you guys and I additionally i got this sticker book here i think this was uh a, i'm not really sure maybe a dollar or something and it's got uh, a few stickers I mean I don't even that's not, these are not stickers but these first few sheets are printed on looks like vellum and then the latter half is printed on a pretty thick piece of paper these are not stickers but they definitely can be used in any journaling and glued down so yeah I thought this was super pretty and it looks like it's 80 stickers so I'm assuming there's 40 of these on the vellum and then there's 40 of these on this type of paper so if you look at this here let's see if I can get a sheet of paper so you can see that in better detail it looks like it is the same one that is printed on this white paper Let's see. Let's see if that is what I the the order. So it looks like you get two two of the same flower type. Okay. So I'm just gonna go over the white paper because it's easier to see, but you can just assume that you get the same duplicate version of that flower in this vellum paper, which is really really cool. I like that. These are about two inches wide, three inches long. Okay, so I'll just go over that. And it looks like it comes with two of the same flowers, and it looks like it comes with potentially the name of the flower. And they look, some of them, I don't think this one, but they look like they are pressed flowers. This paper isn't exactly white. And it's not really cream, so I would say it's it's a it's an off white. That's, that's great. It's the way that the flowers are kind of muted, I think it goes well with the off white paper. And I love the fact that they have the little tape there with the flower. So yeah, those look like it's been dried and pressed these flowers maybe you can dry and press a lot of these flowers in this manner but I don't think my flowers have ever turned out these this nice <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, yeah I kind of like the fact that they have the flowers named there. Excited to have this book of stickers again with the vellum in the front. Great to use on different mediums. All right, which one should we get? Which one should we open first? Uh, should we just go in order? <laughs> All right, let's just go in order. So each of these again have 50, and these are each, these are definitely stickers. And I want to say, hopefully, that. They are washi consistency. Yep, they are. So that will be great because then it'll make using the stickers and layering them a lot easier. And so the color of the washi will stay more true to itself. I think each of these flower pages are going to be unique. This video is going to be put to music and I'm going to fast forward through this because I cannot flip through these as fast as I would like. Yeah. Oh, sunflowers. I want to get better at naming these flowers. All right. I will be putting all the rest to music. Hopefully you guys will enjoy the flip through.
right, everybody, I just did the quick flip through of all of the sheets in this sticker pad, and I really am happy with this purchase. So if I ended up using even half of these stickers, I probably would repurchase something very similar to this. I just love these little sticker pads, and I love the fact that you can kind of see them very quickly, as well as this is very portable if you kind of have a theme that you want it to work on you can always just grab one of these and go in your everyday carry and keep these around and i love the fact that these are washi stickers so that i feel like they layer really nicely on top of other stickers so i would definitely definitely recommend this at the time that i purchased this this was 8.99 so that leaves about a stick a dollar a pack and so i think that's a really great deal i think a similar products on Amazon would definitely be, like I said, 30 or 40% more expensive, uh, but you never know. Sometimes Amazon has great deals too, so I still love my Amazon. All right, thank you for watching, and if you like to these kind of hauls and detailed reviews of items, especially craft items, anything stationary related, go ahead and like and subscribe. I would love to have you join my community, and uh, yeah, if you have any stickers in here that you thought were your favorites, please go ahead and leave a comment. I would love to hear your thoughts. I have a few ones um, that I really love, and it, obviously I love florals and watercolor, so these two are awesome. I love the fact that this is mimics more like wallpaper, and I love plants, and I love this fruit one for if when I do my recipe type of journals, and obviously you can't go wrong with butterflies and mushrooms except for there was a few bugs in here which i probably won't know how to use all right thank you guys so much for sticking around until next time bye